Okay, so this is the first test of bin picking. Um, I haven't tried it yet, so we're gonna see what happens. Uh, so here is uh, the AGV. Um, it's just moving around right now as if it was anywhere else. Uh, it hasn't really mapped out the room yet, uh, so it's coming over here. So it's positioning, here's our bin. Um, this is just stuck here. There's no fixturing or anything holding it there. Um, now the, uh, you can see it takes a picture, then it moves uh, itself to line itself up with uh, the labeling on the bin. Uh, it translates the, um, uh, the gripper pose. It moves in to pick up the bin. And it lifts up the bin. And um, none of this is fixed uh, in place. Uh, you know, you can move the bin around, you can move the bin, you can move the bin uh, further in or further out. Uh, you can move the bin up and down and it'll still find it as long as it's in, you know, kind of a rough area. Um, if you've got a shelf of bins, it'll only just pick out the one that you want. Um, so yeah, anyway, uh, maybe I'll see if we can run it. See, you can see I'm just like sticking the bin on here. Uh, nothing precise. Um, so I'm going to uh, send the robot on a loop again. So it's just going to go run around. Uh, the arm's not going to be sticking out like this when it's um, uh, when it's running normally. Uh, the arm will be in in some position. I just haven't implemented any of that yet. So it's just going over to the CNC machine. Please excuse the wiry mess. And there's not much detail in the room right now. Um, generally, the robot uh, can localize itself better with more detail. Um, one of the things to note is, uh, actually, I'll get to it after. Um, so the robot's in position. Uh, then it runs the script to take a picture. Uh, it detects uh, the bin. Uh, it applies, uh, it, it lines up the camera with the center of that label. Then it applies the tool transform. And then, um, uh, and that uh, just puts the marker at the right spot. Then it puts itself all the way in. Uh, it lifts the bin. So you can see we're also working at a full arm extension. Uh, the reason for this is that uh, it just creates more air. Um, so you can see that we've actually locked it out now because we reached too far. Um, so that just means that we need to move the AGV in a little bit further. Um, yeah, so uh, that just helps us because the closer we are to the bin, the more accurately we can position it. So I'm trying to develop it all uh, as far away uh, from the thing um, as possible. Um, so yeah, anyway, uh, that works. Now to uh, expand on it.